Sunrise over the Fox River, signaling a new day in Batavia, Illinois. It has the look and feel of small town America, but don't let the windmills fool you. We actually were at one time the windmill capital of the world. We produce more windmills here than anywhere. And while those days are a part of the city's history, Batavia and business continue to be a perfect match. I've owned this for 31 years. My father came to Batavia in 51 and he owned it. It's a nice community. Uh, the community has definitely changed in the past 30 years. We have now more people living in Batavia since 1996 that have moved in than the people, the old time townies, like a guy like me that have been here prior to that. From, you know, 7,000 back in the uh, 70s when I grew up here uh, to present day, you know, we're at 25,000. A lot more opportunities, I think, for people. You know, we have all the advantages of downtown Chicago, the cultural advantages, and, uh, and then all the family advantages out here in the Fox Valley. It's a town that has a lot of character, a lot of spirit, and a lot of goodwill. One of the best examples in the community is our river walk. I mean, for over eight years on Saturdays, I mean, that was built largely by Boy Scouts and the Lions Club and the JCs and the Rotaries and just citizens around the community rolling up their sleeves and getting to work. So I think our, our town is a roll your sleeves up town. When we want something, we go after it and we go till we get it done. So it should come as no surprise when city leaders set out to welcome new businesses, they go all out, offering advantages other cities just can't match. DuPage Airport is just around the corner. Interstate 88, right down the street. And having things like a top-rated school system and a large and diverse labor pool are just the beginning. I think the unique thing for Batavia probably than most other communities because we have our own electric utility. People in Batavia save about 20% on their electric um, energy by being here in town. So it's just uh, local control, locally owned, good rates. Uh, it works well for everyone. That goes for power-intensive industries, as well as local retailers. Batavia's business landscape is a cut above the rest. If you want to be an independent like me, there's still opportunities for independence. For corporate, take a look at what's happening on Randall Road. Certainly that's a, you know, a gold mine for them. But will this downtown take off again? Yes, it's been very good to the Foltises for 50 years. We've got a lot of great natural amenities that kind of set the stage for all the businesses to prosper downtown. Not to mention a local government dedicated to helping companies succeed, investing tens of millions in utilities, renovating its infrastructure. It's all a part of the city's vision. Even the U.S. government banks on Batavia, sending its best and brightest to work at the Fermi National Accelerator Laboratory a facility producing more benefits than just high energy physics. There are the obvious economic advantages of the government funding that, that spills into the community, and, but it brings us tremendous international diversity because of the scientists that come from around the world. And the, the technology, we have just recently invested a tremendous amount of money on electric substation and internet connectivity to connect Batavia and Fermilab with Northern Illinois University uh, and the fiber optic cable that, that transverses uh, I-88. So that gives Batavia tremendous uh, information and data technology advantage. And those kind of investments are going to pay big dividends for everyone, our residents, the commercial and the industrial people. Proving it's a new day in more ways than one, the sun is shining on Batavia, Illinois. It's a great place to live and work, and I've been here for now for 16 years and wouldn't want to be anywhere else. We love it here. It has all the amenities. We have a, a wonderful school system, uh, library system, tremendous park district. The Being near the river when our kids were growing up, just the opportunity to spend Saturdays on our bikes on the river from park to park and slide to slide and swing set to swing set uh, were just phenomenal. If I were wanting to come to a community, this would be a great area to come to. It's a good place to, to uh, have a business. <laughs>